All right, this is a video on the guts of a Chicago Electric Power Systems, which is a Harbor Freight house brand uh, model 93781 uh, battery charger. A bit of a... Actually, I think it's a dead bug. Anyways, there's a little PCB. It's a... Uh, what is it? It looks to be... Um, kind of a hybrid composite material where it's a mixture of fiberglass and uh, paper phenolic resin type board material. Uh, this particular PCB is just for the idiot lights on the front panel which are just a couple of uh, T1 and 3 quarter or order um, uh, LEDs, nothing fancy. And this is the main printed circuit board, a load of what appear to be 1% tolerance resistors, which, as with this being cheap Chinese electronics, means that those are probably not, because in China, these uh, out-of-spec 1% tolerance resistors are available for insanely cheap prices. So lots of very low-end uh, Chicom electronics use them. There's... This um, TO220 package device on a heatsink that this little fan blows on, which of course, the way it's oriented, it's blowing on the side that doesn't have fins on it, so not the best uh, design there, but then again, Chinese made what you expect. That's a TIP 42C um, transistor, and there are a pair of uh, DIP8 integrated circuits, one of which is a... Um, LM393 uh, um, comparator and an LM358 operational amplifier for um, 5408 uh, 3 ampere 1000 volt <coughs> rectifiers on the input from the transformer and this big resistor which is probably judging by its location probably current sensing and other than a couple of uh, devices these uh, TO92 um, package devices which are labeled V1s and V2 so those might be potential regulators and not uh, transistors so those are probably providing reference potentials as a um, S8013 right there and this one is 78L12 yeah that's a potential regulator that one probably is but it's some obscure uh, non-standard part name at least non-standard over here and as I mentioned before there's a fan and not much else.